In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a power pack or model train controller. I'll show you how to make a dual cab power pack and a single power pack. First, I'll take you through the parts, showing you what parts you use. Then I will show you the dual power pack in operation and give you a full explanation of what's there. We'll then take you on over to show you the internals of a power pack, how they're wired, and how it operates in single cab operation. So let's get started by looking at the dual cab power pack. We'll use motor controllers with a reversing switch. Specifications about that are below. Here is a kit. It also shows you the parts that you need. The parts you need are the motor controller, then two male plugs that fit into the side of the box, and a female screw connector to which you hook wires that you lead to your track. This is a DIY power pack or train controller for controlling DC or analog trains. It's a two cab train controller. You can make it single cab, but in this case, let's look at what we have. Test tracks here can represent two blocks or concentric ovals. I can operate each train independently and I can operate both trains at the same time at different speeds. Very easy to use and a lot of fun. This is how your motor controller is wired. There are four connections on the side of the board labeled in and out. The two red wires from your reversing switch and two black wires go together. You can put them on left or right, no problem. You also have on each side of the board a connection M1, M2, and connection plus minus. Those go to the male connectors. One brings power in and the other goes back. Then up in the top, your throttle clips right in. It's easy to see connection easily made. Now, this is what it looks like on my test board. You notice how the switch is in those four connectors, throttle to the side. I have power to a 12 volt, a wall wart, and, and then I have power to the track through a screw connector. Very simple setup. Now what we're going to do is show you how this operates. All that you have to do now is install this in a wooden box or plastic box. You can get the kit, you can get boxes, you can get everything you need down below. I hope you've enjoyed this. I, I hope it helps. Have a good day, have a good life, and I would really appreciate it if you give this a like.